Hey, and welcome to some uh, more Fallout. I had to re reboot that thingy real quick. I'd hit a button. I had, I hit the wrong button, but don't judge. Why well, am I? I'm an idiot. Never mind. I thought my TV just went black and then realized probably didn't. Don't feel like explaining it. Anyways, no, um, I was casting another stream and uh, realized it went black, so uh, that's probably where that's from. Let me just double check. We got the game. All right, just one second for me to get all of my backup thingies. All my stuff stuffed up, something like that. All right. Oh, come on. Well, I've just got to restart my phone. That's all good and fine and dandy. Dandy.
Alright, that was a bit long taken to get back to that, but uh, we're back. We're running. I think everything's good. Alright, that was a bit long taken to get back to that, but uh, great. We're back. Except for my audio. My audio's messed up again. Really loving what's going on today with all of my shit. I need to switch headphones. Hopefully this will just work. Getting really bad feedback through my other ones. Alright, that sounds pretty good. No, no. Oh, Jesus. There we go. All right. Piper keeps cranking. Stop worrying so By the way, guys, um, I gotta head into the office. You guys, watch my video YouTube. I did a little unboxing today, a new desk thing, and I got a little, little mini Piper. Piper, three papers, newcomers. If the institute grabs you in the night, at least be warned. Oh no, I lost her. Oh, I can get a haircut. I hear there's a bar in the old theater district that's for raiders only. Combat's And just say yes. It's all he understands. What are you saying? Yes? Takahashi. 
Oh, Piper's j oh, that's just someone walking into a wall. I'll take a look. Sure. Feel bad. I really, uh, damage 38. I think my hammer does more. You right? The new word kind of travels fast in Diamond City. What can I say? Name's Arturo Rodriguez. If you need protection, let's talk. My son's missing. Is there anyone in town who can help? Uh, look, I want to take care of my customers, but with all that talk about the institute in the papers. I just can't get involved in someone else's problems, okay? Arturo, right? I'm just asking for information. That's all. <sighs> okay. There's someone who might be able to help. The alley behind the market. There's a detective agency, Valentine's. You'll see the signs. But don't tell anyone you're going there, okay? Folks don't like that place. Surprised it's even still open. Thanks, Arturo. Yeah, well, good luck. Hope you find your kid. You? I, I don't know you. Just keep your distance. Hey, Solomon. We got Kim's right here for you, brother. I just knew your first name. Did you say something about drugs? That's right. All the Kim's you need to fill out your lifestyle. Balance, yeah. Everyone here buys from me. Sometimes security needs a little psycho, or an engineer needs some mentats. And heck, Brad X is playing Universal. I've got a few minutes to browse. Got your fix.
got small arms, long arms. You know, a shotgun's great in shooting. Big arms, raiders, round arms. I got a lot of options here. You can pick. Let's see what you got. Feel free to test the grips. Is he's playing golf with friends? It's a little early for that. So, let's see if we can find some cells. See if I can find some thirty eights, some cells. Hey, Arturo. We can talk about guns, or maybe you want to consider something more up close and personal. Let's see what you got. Feel free to test the grips. Keep away from my stall. I don't know you. Hey, Myrna. Keep away from my stall. I don't know you. Keep calm. I'm standing still. That's exactly what a synth would say. But I don't know. Are you really, uh, human? Human as the day I was born. Well, you do look human enough. I'll be watching you. I have eyes like a... Well, they're good eyes. Got it? All right. We can do business, but no funny stuff. What kind of business you run in here, anyway? We buy and sell anything and everything. Seven days a week, 24 hours a day. The robot takes care of customers at night. 
Only one I trust to do it. At least I know he's a machine. I'll take a look, sure. A bit of everything. Myrna. And they sell just about everything, but none of it is scrap. Let's see what you have. Here's what we got. Hey, Takahashi. Cleaning out the house again. Yes. Something wrong? The bills. Huh. Ellie Perkins. Bills. Another stray coming in from the rain. Afraid you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... has gone missing. have any idea how I could find him. He disappeared working a case. The Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there they use as a base. 
I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. Hey, I'd love to help, but there's a small matter of expenses. <laughs> Don't play games with me. I'll pay you if you find Nick, but it's going to be a hundred caps. That's the reward, and it's not up for negotiation. Who's this Skinny Malone character? I don't know much about him, but he's from Good Neighbor, and that means he's in the well-pressed suits and machine gun school of thuggery. You said Malone's from Good Neighbor? Yeah, it's a tough neighborhood. Northeast of ways. People with power there care about two things, style and body count. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat getup. Please hurry. Dun 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 dun. Epic music time. Dun 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 dun. Oh god, I don't remember how to put weapons away again. Figured it out. Pulled it out again. Put it away again. Hold it out again. Put it away again. Sticky, sticky, sticky. Sticky. Sticking, sticking. I'm sticking. I'm sticking and I'm taking stuff. No one can hear me. Because I'm sticking and I'm stealing stuff. Uh, yeah, I want those. Alright. I'm gonna leave her some spam or some cram. Cram spam. Some cramp, some cramp, spam cram. <clears throat> Alright. <clears throat> oh, what is up here? It's, it's a trailer on a, th on a, on a roof. That seems safe. Uh, okay. Now, oh, kitten. Uh oh, I'm stuck. I fell. Bye, kitten. Find Nick Valentine. A human. Just keep telling yourself that, pal. Hey, Piper. Holding up, Blue? Why are you calling me that? Because you're a vault dweller. <laughs> I know you're not wearing your blue jumpsuit right now, but the pit boy and that fish out of water look. Dead giveaways. So here's the deal I want an interview. Your life story in print. I think it's time Diamond City had a little outside perspective on the Commonwealth. You do that, and uh, I'll tell you what, I'll come with you. Watch your back while you get used to the world above ground. What kind of interview is this going to be? I ask you who you are, get your opinion on life out there, and maybe load up a few tough questions and keep it interesting. What do you say? I say I need to turn some audio up. Oh man, I was supposed to have music off.
You all right? All right, Piper. I'm in. Good. Let's get down to business. So I know you're from a vault. How would you describe your time on the inside? My family and I were frozen. I didn't spend much time in the vault. Wait, <laughs> they boxed you up in a fridge? The whole time? Are you saying you were alive before the war? The war? Which war? The one that gave us this lovely landscape of demolished buildings and nuclear radiation every ten feet? You're telling me you saw everything before they blasted it into pieces? Yes. I'm over 200 years old. Oh my god. The man out of time. So, you've seen the Commonwealth, Diamond City. How does it compare to your old life? Can you even compare the two? The world out here? It's not even close to the one I left. Feeling a little homesick, are we? Can't say I blame you. Now, the big question. You came all this way looking for someone. Who is it? I lost family, okay? I'm trying to get one of them back. What's their name, Blue? Who are they? My son, Sean, was kidnapped. He's not even a year old. The parent after the missing child. As heartbreaking today as it ever was. Tell me, do you suspect the Institute's involved? The Institute? Who are they? That, Blue, is the biggest mystery in the Commonwealth. No one really knows who or where they are, but their handiwork is all over. Synths. Synthetic people. Sent from their hidden labs to do the Institute's dirty work. Sometimes they even replace a person with a synth double. A little covert agent no one would ever suspect. Now, not everything that goes wrong has the Institute behind it, but there's always a chance. That's why I'm asking. I don't know. No one ever does. That's what makes them so scary. For the last part of our interview, I'd like to do something different. I want you to make a statement to Diamond City directly. The threat of kidnapping is all but ignored in the Commonwealth. Everyone wants to pretend it just doesn't happen. What would you say to someone out there who's lost a loved one but might be too scared or too numb to the world to look for them? Hmm. You can only take it one day at a time. Just keep going. That's all anyone can do. We're all just doing what we have to, huh? I think my readers can relate to that. That's everything. It's gonna take some time to put this all together, but I think your story is gonna give Diamond City plenty to talk about. Anyway, I agreed to come with you, right? Watch your back. Just say the word when you're ready. I can't wait to see where the story goes next. Ooh, I leveled up. Hold tab to open perk chart. All right. Requires option four. Going into perception. It's certainly seen better days, hasn't it? Most folks are just looking for a hand. All we gotta do is offer.
I don't feel like going through all this stuff today, so... Maybe constantly trying to kill us, but... Commonwealth never lacks for excitement. Take all that kid's crap. with the real Riley. Where's my brother? I swear, I'm not a simp. Don't shoot, for God's sakes, we're family! Put the gun down, now! He's a simp! He'll kill us all! Kyle, no! Okay, show's over. There are no simps in Diamond City, hear me? Just you folks and your damn paranoia. Move along. Hey. He pulled a gun on me. My own brother. What happened? I'm I'm not a synth. I I told him. I, I kept telling him. Why didn't he listen to me? I, uh, I need a minute. What's everyone still standing around? Officer? I need you to step away, Scabber. I understand, officer. I just want to know what happened. You got bricks for ears? I said get the hell out of here now. I can't believe you eat that food. Only one thing worth buying in a dugout in, and that's the bulls. Yeah, it's gotta eat. What can I say? A real Diamond City boy eats at the noodle stand. Alright, so I think I'm gonna go do the Valentine missions. Oh, I get it. Diamond City, because, like, it's in a baseball field. Hey there. <sighs> Mayor's in no mood to talk about any of this synth nonsense. Unless you're looking for a housing permit, I can't help you. Hey, officer. No funny business around the mayor. Got it? <sighs> now, a swatter. That's a real weapon. Talk to Mo Cronin. He'll fix you up.
Hi, puppy. Who's your puppy? Is this a joke, or did I, like, just step into the elevator of doom? Hey. So, you're that traitor Piper was talking about. Something tells me she's pulled the wool over my eyes again. Am I uh -huh. right? Uh-huh. I didn't mean to lie, officer. It all just happened so fast. Oh, sure it did. Happened so fast you forgot all about basic human decency. Didn't your mother ever teach you to be honest? Anyway, welcome to Diamond City and all that. I gotta get back to work. Danny. You gotta keep watch on the gate. Head on inside. Oh, I'm really glad there's something called Combat Zone. <laughs> Looking for Diamond City? Just follow the signs.
Why do I feel like in a creepy, creepy, creepy? post-apocalyptic nuclear war world that the basement of a church is probably not the greatest place to go. But like... There's probably some cool shit in there, so I might as well go try to loot it. I don't know what kind of creepy crap is gonna be in there. We're going to save real quick. This is so creepy. It's a really bad time to do it, but I really have to go. Actually, it's a really coincidental time to do it. I'll be right back.
Okay, cut the shit. Who is that? I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say...
Malcolm alone's weak. We caught that detective snooping around, and what does he do? Locks him up. Like he ain't got the balls to just kill him. Well, don't let his new girl hear that. She'll start swinging that bat of hers at your face until there ain't no face left. Oh, I'll fight you. I've got us by the balls! Very courageous of you. Here for the detective. Fight! <coughs>
I'm telling you, joining Skinny Malone's crew was the best decision we've ever made. Look at this place. I still say Malone's weak. <laughs> Saw something. Time to. Nice. 
Locked tight. so loud who's there dirty rats making me jumpy 
What was that? That's it. So I got a question. Why the hell would anyone build a vault out of a subway station? This place is like the opposite of airtight. Because they weren't planning to use it, you moron. We used to pull this kind of gun all the time back before the war. Get a bunch of union boys to work some construction job that would go nowhere. Keep everyone on payroll. What?
hear something? Won't work.
dirty rats, making me jumpy. So it was nothing after all. How you doing in there, Valentine? Feeling hungry? Want a snack? Keep talking, meathead. It'll give Skinny Malone more time to think about how he's gonna bump you off. Don't give me that crap, Valentine. You know nothing, you got nothing. Really? I saw him writing your name down in that black book of his. Lousy cheating card shark, I think were his exact words. Then he struck the name across three times. Three strikes? In the black book? Try to put you on our You gotta hack that terminal to open up this door.
There we go. Haha, <laughs> my knight in shining armor. Question is, why does he come all this way? Risk life and limb. My son, Sean, is missing. He was kidnapped. But I don't know who took him or where they went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right... Right man, not the right place. All right, my mic's been muted for like, I don't know, half hour. Been here for weeks. Turns out the runaway daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got troubles, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Let's blow this joint. <sighs> Malone's crew here used to be small time. Muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger players. I don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. Empty vault. Perfect hiding. Hold up. I hear some of them coming. There they are. How do you want to play this? His only job is to check on the prisoner. Nick. Why you help me get out of here. Off. Then I'll help you. Nick Dino. Quit razzing that detective and get down here. Where the heck is he? Hard and loud, huh? Well, it gets the job done. Bad for whoever cleans up the floor. This door's on the fritz. Let me see if I can get it open. There we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. Who said? You're dead! Mm. Hmm. 
You're trying to give me a heart attack? Thanks. Nice. Hey, Valentine. I know you have a case you want to solve. Underground and surrounded is not the best place to talk. Using a stealth boy or something? Won't work. More stairs? Who built this damn vault? A fitness instructor? Oh no, I should have just kept shooting. Tried to do some like melee game. I don't know why. Dang it. It's knocking everything off my desk now. Hey you! I'm all the way back you know here. You are, but we got three minutes before they realize muscles for brains ain't coming back. Get this door open. Nice. Haha, <laughs> my knight in shining armor. Question is, why does he come over? All right, before I go through all this again. Risk life and I have to go to the bathroom. Pretty bad. Old private eye.
before I get back to things, I'm going to take a uh, quick second, just jump in, see what my friends are up to. I plan for like another couple minutes and then EU4. Sounds good. Sweet. Doing. You want to play some EU4, Jigs? Yeah. Oh, he's I've... outside. He's outside. Oh, God. Give me a second to uh, get this dude out of this uh, oh, this vault real quick. Uh, Plus, go and I are playing CSGO for another maybe 20 minutes or so. All right, cool. We'll um, we'll shoot see. me a message on Steam when you guys are done. I would love to. We need one more kill, Eric. Uh... Oh, All right, so looks like... Uh... Gonna be another tragic EU Fortnite after this, maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how this is going. I'm kind of enjoy playing this right now. So, uh... my son Sean is missing. He was kidnapped, but I don't know who took him or where they went. Missing kid, huh? Well, you came to the right man, not the right place. I've been cooped up in here for weeks. Turns out the runaway. I probably like janked the cutscene all up, but my audio sounds horribly quiet. I don't necessarily know why. Unless something in the volume mixer. Oh. Oh. All right. Guess not. Sorry about that. way daughter I came here to find wasn't kidnapped. She's Skinny Malone's new flame. And she's got a mean streak. Anyway, you got trouble, and I'm glad to help. But now ain't the time. Let's blow this joint. Then we'll talk. Let's go. Malone's crew here used to be small time. Muscled out of the old neighborhood by bigger play. I'm just sorry again. I'm curious about a hotkey, so to speak. Just quick save F five. All right. Oh, it's normally like a standard. Don't know what happened to the previous owners, but they're not exactly around to charge rent. Empty vault. Perfect hideout. Some of them coming. There they are. How do you want to play this? His only job is to check on the prisoner. Why does that take so fucking long, huh? Hey, Dino, quit razzing that detective and get down here. Where the heck is he? No ammo. See if this guy will walk back over there. Yes, we're not alone.
Uh, I don't know why I picked that up. I mean, it's not like you really gave me Let me see if I can get it more open. choices. You just kind of stood there. Um, Almost got. There we are. Hell of a lot easier to do when the lock isn't on the other side. Fidgets. Who? You're listening to, uh, uh, shoot, fix, shoot. Stairs? Who built this damn fall? A fitness instructor? Leaving so soon. I was just starting to admire it. And there's a creepy nursery here. Ooh. What do I have right now? Submachine gun. I'm on a time limit. Should be looking at my inventory. Let's 
Skinny Malone and the rest of his boys are waiting for us somewhere. The name's, uh, ironic, but don't let that fool you. He's dangerous. Another locked door. Shouldn't be too hard. Okay, I got it. But I hear big fat footsteps on the other side. Once we step through this door, get ready for anything. Loading, just another screen, and I'm loading. What are you doing? And I'm here. Come into my house, shoot up my guys. You have any idea how much this is gonna set me back? I wouldn't be here if it weren't for your two-timing dame, Skinny. You ought to tell her to write home more often. Oh, poor little Valentine. Ashamed you got beat up by a girl. I'll just run back home to daddy, shall I? Should have left that alone, Nikki. This ain't the old neighborhood. In this vault, I'm king of the castle, you hear me? And I ain't letting some private dick shut us down now that I finally got a good thing going. I told you we should have just killed him! But then you had to get all sentimental. Conversation with Darla's parents when I tell them their daughter bit the big one. Well, at least the case is closed. Let's get out of here. There's a service ladder that should take us right to the surface.
Oops. Oh, I remember that guy. I killed him. I own a tuxedo now. My armor probably doesn't do anything, now that I'm really kind of thinking about it. I need to go back this way. And it's daytime, so I'm gonna like kind of run a little more. so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. How did you know where to find me anyway? Not many people knew where I went. Your secretary, Ellie, she sent me. She did? I should give her a raise. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, and how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. 
Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. Lead the way, Nick. All right, let's move fast. Follow me. on the other side. Oh, that's my own guy. Why would I shoot him? We're friends. Chained on the other side. Did you hear that? Hey, fuck with that. Ouchie. Huh, I don't remember the last time I saved it. Pip, <laughs> pip, 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 pip. Ouch. That hurt. The worst part is looking up at my, my TV and seeing it again two seconds later. Yeah. Alright. I don't think I necessarily need to get in a fight with these guys. Side of that building. Ah, look at that Commonwealth sky. Never thought anything so naturally ominous could end up looking so inviting. Thanks for getting me out. How did you know where to find me, anyway? Not many people knew where I went. I have my ways. Really? Huh. Well, I'm glad those ways included shooting down mobsters. Wasn't looking forward to haunting that place. Now, you mentioned something about your son, Sean, and how he went missing. I want you to come to my office in Diamond City. Give me all the details. Besides, I think you've earned a chance to sit down and clear your head. Lead the way, Nick. All right, let's move fast. Follow me. I hope you were smarter than this.
Where'd that little fucker go? I don't know if I should have gone down there. Probably, probably shouldn't have gone down there. I'm gonna six real quick. Time to really If that really just did it, there has to be something in there, right? That's that that would only make sense.
God, if this game wasn't so big, it'd be on a solid state. Trust me. That's when I came up here. Oh, wait. <laughs> You'll run out of bullets at some point. I leveled up. Oh, fell down. Fell down. Fell down. Inventory, I'm carrying too much. Ooh, this looks like a nice view. There's a nice view. I should get up there. there. I can jump that. I don't think I can jump that. Probably my favorite view of the game. I wish I could like just keep check mark on the spot. This would be my hangout. There's some heads. Shit. He looks pissed. Um, can I get down by jumping? Is that like I'm probably gonna die. So I need to go down, and it's going to take like 30 minutes to live through here, but I need to get this guy quickly as possible back to Diamond City, um, especially because there's got to be something else in here. Really not? Is that like, that was it? I just saw this weird, like, uh, phase through real life moment where I was like, oh, a toaster. And I was like, I need a toaster. And then I was like, oh, wait, I need a toaster in real life. Um, so this, this specific toaster in Fallout will not, will not suffice. I'm sorry. And now we're loading. Loading. Out of New Orleans, just keep loving, loving alone. One of my favorite Grateful Dead songs, "Trucking." Good old, good old song about some good old boys. Um, God, this takes forever. All right, now we're back down here. Let me, uh... I don't know what that does, but let's just... Oh, take... Can't carry too much. Did something. I just want to see what that does real quick. So we'll just drop some shit. Let's drop that. Let's drop that. Gotta keep the tuxedo. We can get rid of the casual outfit, even though I think it's hilarious that my Fallout character can look like. Right, we should be good there. Shouldn't be too much. 
Irritated auto pimp. What? Perfect. I gotta see that. Does 50 additional radiation damage. Ooh. I'll take that. Duct tape. Some shit. All right. Probably I'm like passing up some serious armor. I'm not going all the way back up there for that other shit. So I'm just looking. So, what it looks like is like, oh, that's a whole thing, it's 5-7. But if that does 6, like, that does 5, does that mean it's like, well, those are the same, like, I don't know. Maybe I can just take my thing to a thing and see if it thinks some things, you know? Where's my homie? Did he leave without me? Go to Valentine's Detective Agency. Yeah, he left without me. What? Hey, dick. Oh, God. I'm really glad I found that sledgehammer. His name is Sludgy. He's a good boy. Quit exploring, you gotta finish this fucking shit. It scared me. It was music and it scared me. Boston Public Library. I'm gonna go explore that sooner than later. I like how I'm actually, for the first time in... Oh shit. Boston, that's pretty cool. Ooh. Alright. Let's just check it out. Alright, well oh, didn't see anything that stood out. Alright, let's get out of here. Let's go back.
Head on inside. Not to be rude, but I'm a bit busy here. <coughs> Elevator time. Go. Oh, no. oh. Oops. I got stuck in the elevator door. <laughs> All right. Hey, there's my dog. Hey. Come on. Over here. Hey. Head over there. My dog just appears down there. I'm gonna let my ass off. Oh my god, he is. That's funny. Looks like it's night time and yeah. Oh, get it open. All right, I can wait to do that. Yeah. Before I walk in there and do some cutscenes, let me uh. Level up. So I can do. God, this is killing me now because. I'd really like that to be up to 40%. But what I think I'm gonna do... Is do the lockpicking one. Next one I'll do is the... I'm gonna beef my pistol up to 40 Are you here? Nick? Oh god, it's really you. <laughs> well, it's hard to mistake this mug for anyone else. <laughs> you keep laughing at death. Someday death's gonna laugh back. Not as long as I got a few friends to back me up. You saved Nick, this agency, and my job. Thank you. Happy to do it. Yeah? Go diving into scary pre-war ruins all the time then, do you? Here. Every cap we agreed to for finding him. Plus a little something extra. You know, if you're looking for work and don't mind putting on the detective hat, Nick sure could use a new partner. Whoa. One case at a time, Ellie. Our new friend needs our help first. All right, let's get down to business. Take a seat. Make yourself comfortable. You're trying to find someone who's gone missing. The devil is in the details. Tell me everything you can, no matter how painful it might be. In 
that is where I end part two of Tales of Lord Boof and Stoof. Uh, yeah, so uh, part one may or may not actually be up. Um, Get hit in the head. It's a pretty interesting like endeavor, way. but it was a lot of shenanigans and a lot of nothing, to be honest. Um, so I may just start posting with part two, because we just about hit my three-hour mark. So, um, thanks for watching, guys. I think I'm going to go over and uh, finish out some other stuff. But, uh, yes, sir, yes, sir.